As a deer longs for streams of cool water, so I long for you, O God. We are here, God. We have felt your touch in the sunlight, seen your power in the salt waves. We have wondered at your mystery in the stars, and we marvel that the maker of the universe knows us by name. We are here, God. We are here to praise you and to worship you. We are here, Jesus. We know that you came to find us. We have listened to your words and smiled at your stories. We have felt the warmth of your love and we thank you that you have called us friends. We are here, Jesus. We are here to praise you and worship you. We are here, Holy Spirit. We are grateful for your presence, grateful for the way you bring us close, for the way you comfort us and challenge us and keep us right. We are here, Holy Spirit. We are here to praise you and to worship you. We are here, God, in this moment, in this place, where people have prayed for centuries and we thank that you are here with us tonight. You, you know, know us, God. God. We do not have to pretend with you. Listen to the words of Jesus, words that we can trust. Do not be afraid. I love you. Your sins are forgiven. I will be with you always. Write these words in our hearts, loving God. Let them take root in our living. Amen. As he walked along, he saw a man blind from birth. His disciples asked him, Rabbi, who sinned, this man or his parents, that he was born blind? Jesus answered, Neither this man nor his parents sinned. He was born blind so that God's works might be revealed in him. I must work the works of him who, him who sent me while it is day. Night is coming when no one can work. As long as I am in the world, I am the light of the world. When he had said this, he spat on the ground, made mud with the saliva, and spread the mud on the man's eyes, saying to him, Go wash in the pool of Siloam, which means scent. Then he went and washed and came back able to see. The neighbours and those who had seen him before as a beggar began to say, Is this not the man who used to sit and beg? Some were saying, It is he. Others were saying, No, no, but, it, but it's someone like him. He kept saying, I am the man. But they kept asking him, Then how were your eyes opened? He answered, the man called Jesus made mud, spread it on my eyes, and said to me, Go to Siloam and wash. Then I went and washed and received my sight. They said to him, Where is he? He said, I do not know. For the word of God in Scripture, for the word of God among us, for the word of God within us. Thanks be to God. The names of all for whom prayer has been requested in the past week are placed before us. We are your people, God. 
in this time and place, you have called us to pray for those in need. We pray for the people whose names the world knows, whose stories are told daily in the news. God, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray for people in places of suffering, whose names only you, their friends and their families know, and whose lives you cherish. God, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray for the people whose names and lives you know, those who today are in pain or distress or trouble, those who are happy, those who are sad. God, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray for ourselves, God. You know each of us by name. Make us into the people that you want us to be. And when that hurts, reassure us by showing us how much you love us. God, in your mercy. Hear our prayer. God, you taught us to pray. So, in a moment of silence, we pray for all known to us, who tonight need to know you are near. God, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Come, Holy Spirit, you have placed yearning in our hearts. Now bring healing to body, mind and spirit. Bless the heads that bow, the hands that touch, and the hearts that hope. Bring healing, bring peace. Spirit of the living God, present with us now, enfold us, body, mind and spirit, and heal us of all that harms us. In Jesus' name. Amen. For loving the world and knowing our names. Thank you, God. For your strength that fills us and your love that heals us. Thank you, God. For your presence here with us tonight and your hand that leads us into tomorrow. Thank you, God. May the Maker's blessing be yours, encircling you round, above you, within you. May the angel's blessing be yours and the joy of the saints to inspire you, to cherish you. May the sun's blessing be yours, the wine and the water, the bread and the stories to feed you, to remind you. May the spirit's blessing be yours, the wind, the fire, the still, small voice to comfort you, sometimes to disturb you. And may our own blessing be yours, a blessing rooted in our common pilgrimage, the blessing of friends. Amen.